100 years after people. Water has attacked New York's co-op city from above and below. These flat roofs drain to the inside, to internal drains. So the water has no place else to go. It's going to drain through those leaks. Once it starts doing that, it invades the insulation underneath. Meanwhile, the sinking land has reverted to tidal mudflats. And Co-op City resembles an apocalyptic Venice. The area of the building that is in this in the splash zone where waves are hitting it or the water level is rising and lowering with the tide. That splash zone is where it's going to fail. A massive winter storm blows in from the northeast. It's the nor'easter that would really do you in. You would get a fair amount of wave pounding against the building itself. That would begin to displace the building. The weakened splash zone buckles under the nor'easter's assault. And the former homes of 55,000 New Yorkers are swallowed by the shifting tides. 